Hey guys, I just wanted to get on here real quick and do my hair real quick. Can you see that? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, so getting ready to go to work. I just wanted to show you. So I blew a dry yesterday and today I have it in these funky little braids they look really tight but i'm hoping it will turn out with a cute style i'm just putting a little bit of argan oil on my hands let me take this out and see what we got Somebody told me when my hair like this it looks like I have, I look like Snoop. <laughs> Before Snoop, I look like relaxed. Snoop. Anyway. So one thing I can say about my journey is that a routine definitely Deems results. Some people are lucky and they can just grow their hair along and luscious without a routine. I'm um, not one of those people. So I pretty much put my hair in braids. And I'm gonna try and rock a braid up today. We'll see how the heat treats my hair. It'll probably get poofy throughout the day, but if it does, I'll just put my hair in a hair tie. I'll just put my hair in a hair tie. And considering I don't wear my hair down most of the time, I may not it down the whole day. We'll see. We'll see how I feel. So yes. If you have a hair routine, what is your hair routine? Do you wash your hair once a week? Do you co-wash? Do you deep condition? I moisturize daily and right now since the monsoon season is a little humid. The humidity is actually maintaining a lot of moisture in my hair. So I've been recently washing and deep conditioning every two weeks. And then once the air gets dry, I'll we'll probably go back to every week during our winter season, which really isn't a winter, it's just, we call it less hot. But yes, a routine creates results. And I also do take a lot of pictures of my hair to see how much progress I've made between now and when I started 10 months ago in October. And it was long, but I think it's a lot healthier now. I'm just gonna fluff it a little bit. Not too much, because with the humidity, my hair will fluff up throughout the day. Also, if you do have a routine, how often do you trim? How often do you feel like you need to trim? I've just been kind of doing it since I got my major trim in October, I've just been kind of doing it as I see fit. Back in, I think February, I trimmed way too much off. And I 
I kind of stunted my progress a little bit, but now it's back and it's longer than it was when I did that trim last time. <clears throat> and it's fuller. So I'm trying to figure out what to do with these front pieces. So I need to start applying that philosophy with everything else that I do. Since I have a hair routine, I need a better workout routine. I need a better organizing team, uh, routine. Yeah. Yeah. And then once you measure your progress, like I said, I did, um, you know, I did better than I, I'm doing better than I was doing two months ago or five months ago or 10 months ago or whatever. I'm just grabbing some bobby pins and I'm not, I'm doing like a superficial, um, I use these most of the time. I don't use like the bobby pin bobby pins, but almost like clamps because anything to help, um, not weigh down my hair. That's what I'm trying to do. I may change this, but this is pretty much what I'm gonna be how I'm gonna be wearing it today. <clears throat> and I do see <laughs> a hair tie in my near future. So, let me show you that real quick. Yeah, this hair is already big, so I'll probably be clipping it back throughout the day. But this is what it is for right now. So, anyway, I hope you guys are well love and light and yeah i'll see you guys later love and light bye